Ladies and gentlemen, I'm gonna slay God. Huh? And it all starts by killing this tarantula, cause it is raining, meaning a rare creature can be summoned. Get this loser out of here, team. Thank you, kill him. Cause now we can summon out someone else. What is it? Just a praying mantis. All right, well, still kill him because it's fun. And of course, we need to take care of my pesky red ant problem. Good thing I'm what's known as immensely strong, and there's nothing to be afraid of when it comes to just dead ants. All right, we kill their mother. We deserve this. Thanks, team. Appreciate you. Maybe I need to pick nicer words. <laughs> that was gruesome. And now the anniversary event is still going on. I'm at 200 out of 1,000 before I can get another Emperor Scorpion. So of course, let's make my wallet cry by buying a nice little cake too. How delicious. All right, everyone. Happy birthday to me. Come eat this. It's for the good of us. I've also saved up nearly two thousand honeydew, meaning I can increase my soldier ants resilience to plus 20%, increase my fusion chance by 2%, increase my ants movement speed by 5, same with my workers, and then I can have 5 more soldier ants. You know, as if my army wasn't scary enough, I think a demonstration is in order. Help! Help me! He got me! Help! <laughs> Pretend you didn't see that. Aphid Farm's been conquered. Wait, <laughs> hold on, I'm not there. I'm glad that my soldier ants took the initiative and proceeded to avenge me, but now all the aphids are gonna die. Run, I'll hold him back. I'm I'm actually kind of holding him back somehow. I didn't think that would work. We got this team. Wow, my soldier ants are so much faster now. I didn't think that speed boost would actually be worth it, but these guys are zooming. How are all 10 aphids still alive too? Oh. You know, I need not question it. Also, my upgrades are finally done. So my seed storage, <laughs> this takes a week. Oh man. Man, this game is really just bringing the worst out of me, huh? Well, the good news is this delectable looking cake, which oddly enough was my nickname in high school, provides nice little infinite resources for 24 hours. So that really shouldn't be an issue for upgrading. What I need to do is get these daily quests out of the way, like watching five ads. That's gonna take me about seven minutes, but for you guys, it's gonna be about one quick edit. The things I do. The whole reason I even want to complete my dailies is these nice little goodies right here anyways. Because ladies and gentlemen, I have overlooked something major for a very, very long time. And it has weighed heavily on my conscience ever since. And I know you might be asking yourself, Cade, do you even have a conscience? And I will plead the fifth. But the fire ant's nest needs to die. And we're one more daily done. Just win five battles. Sounds easy enough. Before we do that though, I have an 87% chance to get a three-star Emperor Scorpion. If this fails, I think I'm gonna have to quit YouTube forever, actually. Oh, thank you. And now let's just fuse the rest of these guys. You think I can get lucky with another three-star by chance? You know, doesn't hurt to try it out. Oh, I'm so happy. There's a 3% chance to make a four-star. <laughs> Yeah, let's not do that. Let's go cause some mayhem. All right, my team, don't be alarmed by anything you might see. Blood, death, violence. You just have to kill everyone. Oh, dodge that bombardier beetle. Actually, just chrysanthemum. Chrysanthemum and then immediately eat him alive. That would be just awful. Oh, he's got a dragonfly? I want a dragonfly. He has two bombardier beetles. Maybe I need to summon out my guys. Even though there's a Venus flytrap that can eat them alive, the important part is not dying. I have lost all my soldier ants already. What are we doing? Just beating up a tarantula over here, team? All right. No, I support that. You want to beat up the centipede next? Help! Help! He wants me! He's chasing me! Kill him! <laughs> All right, team, we're now executing Operation Guerrilla Warfare. It's called Steer Clear the Venus Flytrap, Kill Everything Else. This should work if we're lucky and we're swift. I'm hearing the attacks, but we need to go in. Oh, do I just have one scorpion left? This is fine. We can do it. Go! My scorpion! Fight his scorpion! Run in! See each other! You have more stars. Just mathematically, you should win. Wow. Look at the sheer difference. This guy's at half health. I'm at much higher. And that put me... <laughs> and that was enough to give me the victory. <laughs> it don't have to look pretty. It just gotta win. Might I also mention that we have three openings in the clan. If you want to take over the world together, now's the time. Hey, my soldier ants are refreshed. Let the onslaught continue. What kind of messed up creature is that? It's dead, so I guess I don't have to be that worried, but still. If there's one thing I never get tired of, it's wiping out my entire enemy force. But now, of course, if I wipe out the entire top half of his base and I'm not even at 10% quite yet, that means all of his things are hanging out in the queen's chamber. An ambush is a coward's tactic. You know what isn't a coward's tactic? Stunning all of his creatures and then running in. Oh wait, go! Chrysanthemum, lavender, kill, murder, death, violence. You know, the yards. Did we do it? 
Is everyone dead? I'm seeing a lot of red health bars still. Let's go ahead and fix that team. Sometimes attacking is just watching a massive dog pile of creatures and hoping yours come out on top. However, for me, things like that, well, now it's just really only natural, huh? Now we just need a few more wins. See you in a second. I think something crazy just happened as I was waiting for my ants to respawn. Sometimes I get bored and decide to do a little pheromone summoning. And I just pulled another bombardier beetle. Quit pointing your butt at me. Stop it. Everyone kill him. That's why I love that guy. You'll be mine soon enough, Mr. Beetle. All right, ready, set, murder him. I'm gonna run all the way over here so he gets distracted. Oh yeah, this feels good. This is, I like this. If you don't mind, buddy, you mind just going into the afterlife for me? Thank you. Capture. If I already have a force that's capable of something like this, well now what happens when I add a second beetle? Well now there's one way to find out, isn't there? Anyone up for a little casual murdering? I know I am. First things first, I have to clear this stupid top area, which is really rough with this tiger beetle. Ah, screw it. If I can kill his Venus flytrap, I can summon out my troops. We'll win. Because we both know that butterfly isn't doing anything. It ran away. It literally ran away. All right. Flytrap's dead. Kill this stupid beetle. Thank you. Just keep murdering everything, especially this guy, because he's stupid and I hate his face. Glad we had this talk, team. Oh, he has a bombardier beetle here. Dodge it. All right. Lavender. Stun. My turn. Eat them alive, bombardiers, ox beetle, just literally everybody. I think all of his soldier ants are dead now. And there goes one of his creatures. Yep, both bombardiers are just right there aiming at all three creatures. <laughs> Look at the health bars getting melted. Am I lucky or am I just that good? Nope. The answer, a little bit of both. Fight. Oh no, 25 seconds left. Whatever will I do? I sure hope I'm not insanely strong. That would be awful. Anyways, this queen ant's health isn't long for this world. That feels good. No, that's, that's a good victory. Because now my daily quest are completed, which means in the resin shop, I can upgrade my own little move speed. So now I'm just 10% faster. It also means I can attract another Emperor Scorpion. All right, eat him alive. My preparations almost completed. Just right after this guy's health goes from 100% to non-existent, that is, capture. Yoink. And now with my 10% movement speed buff, well, that's where things get fun. Lead the way, my army of ants. Just tear through them, please. Thank you. All right, then we're good to disband. You guys can do whatever you want. Upgraded speed just means I can do this even easier now. And there is something in here that I desperately am wanting. Wow, I am zooming through this. Made it into the hexagon with five minutes and 14 seconds still on the clock. And I've been hit once. I should have upgraded my speed a long, long time ago. For instance, I'm 20 seconds ahead of the fastest that I've ever done this. And I've just negated that by running into the wall. <laughs> All right, maybe I just gotta shut up. Let me slip in. Yes! Get in, stun the queen, grab the honeydew, leave. Now, I've been hit a very, very large amount of times, and I'm still leaving with nearly a minute and a half left on the nice. clock. That 10% is such a crazy upgrade. <laughs> Hi, Garrison Unit. Thanks for keeping me safe. An easy 75 honeydew banked for the taking. Now to just do that one more quick time. Emphasis on the quick. Bye, stupid queen. Bye, stupid queen. You know, it's a really good thing bees have no pattern recognition, otherwise I would be in trouble. I also just made that fact up, but it's probably real. Of course, I have successfully escaped the honey hell, which was actually my nickname in college, and it will now be safely deposited. Oh, and I can summon another scorpion. I don't see why not. Rip him to shreds. While they do that, I will be spending my hard-earned honeydew to increase the soldier ant's move speed even more. Why did he turn blue? What just happened? Anyways, capture him, and let's run, team. Oh, they can actually kind of somewhat keep up with me. And currently, that's as strong as I can make all of my soldier ants. And so I think it's finally time. Let's rip him to shreds. What it- oh, just fire ants nest is so many- Oh, I get all 50 of my soldier ants? How cool is that? All right, chamber one done. On to chamber two we go. It's just more fire ants. That's fine. We're cooler. Continue to eat everyone alive. Man, if it keeps going at this rate, we'll be home in time for dinner. There are actually spiders around, which is just more annoying than anything. That's fine. We've got 40 of you guys. Should be able to eat them pretty easily. On to chamber four. How scary is this about to actually start getting? Oh, I have Chris Anthony and stuff? I didn't even realize that. We'll kill the guy who's stuck real quick and then kill his buddy who came to help out and then kill his buddy who came to help out. I didn't even realize I had my lovely little stun flower down here. That would have made everything so much easier. And you're dead. I've lost like 20 troops, but I think we're actually still doing a-okay. I should have just chrysanthemum both of those mantis and that I did. Can you kill these guys a little faster, please? Get this guy who's still stunned over here. Oh, we're 
we're going from 50 down to 27. That's all right. I still believe in us. Eat him alive because he sucks and I hate him. Thank you. Chamber five cleared. On to chamber six. Oh, it's more praying mantis. I want all three of them to go in the same area. They did. Stupid idiots. Get chrysanthemum. Kill the guy who's still awake or kill the guy who's sleeping. That's an option. Oh no, I'm down to 17 ants. It'll probably be 15 by the time I clear this chamber. That's fine. Can he- Why did he- What happens when I die? Is it over if I die? No, I just respawned. Maybe I should die more often. Anyways, on to chamber seven. Oh, tiger beetles. Gross. These guys are such an annoying pain to deal with. Not to mention at level two, their range is just stupidly far. That's fine. I- Ow, he ate me. Oh man, at two stars, these guys aren't no joke. Yeah, no joke indeed. So I'd say I probably need Queen's Chamber level six if I want to take that on, but I do need 10,000 resin. To get 10,000 resin, I need 200 legs. And also to get 10,000 more resin because I'm at 389. Sounds like I've got some more murdering I need to do. Oh yeah, might as well max out my seed storage chamber too. That'll just be done in a week's time.